working on reconstruction of the terminal apron. The terminal apron is really the starting and ending point of every aircraft and every passenger journey at the airport. We fuel aircraft, we load aircraft with passengers and baggage on the terminal apron, then they use our taxiway system to get out to the runways. So right now we're standing on top of Concourse A, which was the starting point of the airport back in 1963. The original terminal building, the air traffic control tower, and Concourse A were all constructed as the starting point of the airport. As airport traffic grew, we expanded the terminal apron, we expanded into Concourse B, and over the years really created the terminal apron that you see as a jigsaw puzzle, adding on as needed. At this point, some of those pavements are over 40 years old, well exceeded their design life, and we're using this opportunity to rebuild the terminal apron as a whole as a new system to function ideally. So the work over the last few months has taken phase one around the south end of Concourse A, removed the old pavement, removed the old underground drainage, and constructed new, well-built, well-designed systems. So we're building a, a concrete pavement section, starting with native clay, adding sand, a little bit of stone, some cement treated base, and a 16 inch concrete section on the top. Uh, they've just finished now placing the new 16 inch concrete section in phase one. Over the next two summers and seven construction phases, we'll reconstruct over 150,000 square yards of concrete. When you look out the window and you see construction happening, you also notice a line of white and orange barricades that draw the line between where aircraft operate and where contractors do the work. That's very specific and that's very deliberate so that we can continue to operate aircraft safely and continue to move thousands of passengers a day in and out of West Michigan while we continue to invest in the infrastructure of the airport.